Danny Thomas show uh, did for a while with Danny Simon. That was very good stuff. Yes, now, that, these, that, that I'm extremely proud of. One of the shows was really one of the best things I had. I were had these with. freelance assignments or were you on staff? Okay, no. Shelton Leonard invited us, me and Danny and a few other people, Las Vegas, the beginning of every year, you know. And we uh, had ideas laid, laid out for us and, and decided upon so that um, then... Danny and I would write write them. You know. mm-hmm. In other words, the ideas were chosen in a in a conference. Now, what was it like to work with Danny Thomas? Well, I, I seldom came across him personally, but um, he was very very good. He was also very brilliant. And t- t- is it Toulouse? Toulouse? The, 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 the corner, another. The, that's my meat, although you know. Right. The outsider looking at the world, the guy yeah. from Le- Lebanon. We did one, King of the Hill, which is something I'm proud of as any uh, as anything else I did. Um, with me with Danny Simon, Danny Simon, right? The story is to Lu- to news this Tunus. foreigner, yes. To news. To news, coming in. Can't take it any longer. We just found out that people were distributing burial places, and he wanted to be on top of the hill, king of the hill, but he couldn't make. But he had to be second. So at one point, um, he comes into the home and begins to disturb it completely. He's telling the children that Columbus was a uh, was from Lebanon. You know, it's totally, totally wrong. He screws up lives, and he. The food he brings in, he make he make he make the whole room look like a like a Turkish whorehouse with <laughs> carpets and so it's, it's funny. And da- and Danny Thomas says, "I'm ashamed of you. He's, you must have respect. Don't kid him. Don't don't uh, make fun of this gentleman. He's from the old boy. You have to give him respect." And so, of course, you know there's a switch coming. And then the maid comes in. And she has the golf bag, and it's full of rice because because Tunus is working on it. And then he rips into him. What the hell is the matter with you? You'll stop that to get the hell out of that. And then he changes his mind again, and he likes him, and he says, let's not forget, it's not where you're buried, but what your, what your life was like, what you did for the world. Because Mozart... Did a lot, and he was, and don't, nobody even knows where he was buried. It's a marvelous story. All added up together. Interesting. <laughs>